And speaking of that air quality, Josh Kozar following all of this and how the weather yeah. could play a factor in, in, you know, which way that smoke shifted. It, it's all going to come down to the winds mm -hmm. as the hot and dry conditions are once again going to ramp up that fire potential. But these were just some of the views over the downtown area from earlier this morning. You can see all of the smoke and haze filling our skies, reducing the air quality, but thankfully now starting to see some improvements as we take a live look across the region. Still going to be holding on to those hazy conditions for the rest of the afternoon and that's going to take us well into Thursday as well as our air quality has improved earlier this morning. Thanks to the structure fire, the Kmart and the one burning out towards the Longview area with that lumber mill causing our air quality to fall back to the unhealthy category. Right now, Portland still remains at moderate levels and will likely see some improvements through the rest of this afternoon and evening. But that Longview fire continuing to push the wildfire smoke to the south, although a fire burning down in southwest Oregon. All of that smoke is expected to move its way up through the I-5 corridor. That's the flat fire burning just to the west of Medford, and that's going to coincide with some hot temperatures that are once again returning to the Pacific Northwest. Today, the hottest day of the week, but the heat continues as we work our way towards the weekend. So, Jenny, coming up in a few minutes, we'll have a better look at that timeline in just a few. All right, Josh, thank you. Happening